Hey guys, it's Amy here, back back to my channel, Sunday day for la la la. I mean, why did I say that? Hola, aloha, bonjour, konnichiwa. Um, I forgot what it is in China. Oh well, we'll figure that out soon. Today, I'm doing another video. Yep, I'm back with the recording setup. You can't see my recording setup very well. I'll fix that some other time. That other time is not today. Anyways. Please make sure you like and subscribe um, before we begin, at least. Before we begin, make sure you like and subscribe, please. I want, like, 20 subscribers. I want, I might get, okay. This, my challenge is, please make it to 30 subscribers. It will really help my channel. I want to continue doing this. So, just please help by subscribing. Also, I broke my camera and it fell from half a foot, and I've dropped it before and it fell from a few feet and it's been perfectly intact. In other words, the side of the lens cracked and it, therefore it did not work. Anyways, what I'm going to I'm going to be doing a video with somebody else. Um, it's called... Okay, not... I really cannot talk today, can I? We're going to be doing, like, childhood memories, funny memories, any memories, really. And I know where I am still a child, there, and my special guest... Um, but, <coughs> but, I mean when we're younger, okay? Good. My special guest is, I'm waiting, Ashton, Yay. again. <laughs> I haven't made a video in months. Okay, anyways, <laughs> Ashton, you go first. Uh, hurry up. You go first. Not told him when you were a baby. <laughs> okay, I, I have okay. an idea for you to start. Um, one story was when I shoved a dandelion. No, tell him the whole story. Okay, so I was at my aunt's house. I took a dandelion. I was like, ooh, what should I do with this? I saw my aunt. I took it. Make a wish. And I said, make a wish. She tried to. I shoved it in her mouth and said, take it, eat it, eat it. And she did it back to me because I wasn't looking one day. It was like the next day. And I forgot everything because I was little. And then she's like, here, you blow a wish. I was like, okay. And I opened my mouth and then she did it in my mouth. So, okay. Yeah. Um, my parents don't even remember this. I, I, so you just get weird, stupid memories that, like, I sometimes don't even remember the por important ones. Like, I do sometimes, but I also don't. Mostly I just remember stupid things. See, so, yeah, in other words, my parents don't even remember this. I've tried telling, I've, I've tried to tell them, like, once. But, okay, anyways. So, I was really, I was pretty young. Is pretty young, like three. We'll go with three, okay? And um, so I don't know. My dad was watching something. It wasn't National Geographic, but it was talking about evolution and how we evolved from apes. And um, I picked up a banana and said, "Daddy, look! I'm a monkey." The T the TV said, "I'm a monkey," and therefore I kept acting like a monkey forever. Not forever, but until like the next year. Okay, another funny story. But not all of them are funny. Keep it in mind. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, I was at my old house because now he lives in there. Yes. And I was really little, and I did out because I, I, I had this TV show. It was on like no, it wasn't a TV show, but it was on YouTube. It was. Is, is this one that's similar to mine? Mm. Anyway, just continue. Anyway, it's. And it said, imagine you were a lion, and I'm a oh, lion. Like, I'm a lion? So then, <laughs> I went to the dinner table, well, because it was dinner, and my mom's like, me. eat your broccoli. And I said, no. So, and you're like, eat it, or you're going to be around. I'm like, hmm. So I take, I was about to eat it, but Wait, then I, you had to, like, a three-year-old got grounded? <laughs> That's pretty That's sad. Yeah. Continue. And, was, and then I flung it at her face. And then she's like, excuse me. And then I was like, 
I'm a lion. Grrr. And I ran it off. And I got really mad, mad at my mom. I end up that day. My dad had a hammer because he was like fixing the house. Wait, no, this is a different story. Wait for the next oh, one. Okay. <gasps> no, you don't. You still can breathe. <laughs> okay, your turn. Okay, breathe. I don't want to death in my room. <laughs> I will be traumatized. Alright, anyways, now what story shall I tell next? Hmm. I still have a lot of good ones, I don't. Alright, hang on, I'm trying to think. Can I tell another oh, I remember, I didn't even tell Ashton this one. Because, like, before this video, we discussed, like, what we wanted to say. So, I didn't, I'm just now remembering it. So, I have a neighbor, she's now our art teacher. I'm not going to say names, we'll just call her... Miss G. That's the start of her name. So, Miss G is now our art teacher. She used to be my babysitter. Along with, it was kind of like a daycare in her house. So, there was a bunch of other kids there. And I remember, like, my first day there. Um, like, I have, I have pictures from there. I'm, no, okay, anyways. But, I was pretty young. I was, like, four, I think. She kind of babysat me for a few years, and, you know, and then she became a substitute in the nurse. Anyways, let's actually get on to the story. Well, it was my first day there, and I did not want to go. So my dad was just taking me across the street to the daycare. To the, we're call it, we're gonna call it a daycare, okay? He's taking me across the street to the daycare, and um, and I'm like, no, I don't want to go. So I was standing at the edge of the garage, like um, on one side of the garage which had like a path that leads to the front door. My dad said, okay, I'm gonna go then. And like, I'm like, no, don't go. And he said, why? You don't wanna go, so sh I should. And I said, because you have to take care of Dante. Dante's my brother and he actually goes to school. I don't know why I said that. And I said, no, you have to go home. And he said, well, you have to go to daycare. And I said, no. Want to. Basically, we just sat there and argued for a while, and he actually legit—he literally walked in, got Miss G, and like she eventually took me inside. I just sat in their basement and hid until I heard my dad. And like while he was inside, I believe—I don't even know if anyone else remembers this. I'm. I could be thinking of another time that I was mad, but I'm pretty sure that day I, like, my dad got in and was saying, like, to Miss G, like, probably something like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm very sorry. And, like, while he was talking to Miss G, there's, like, the, a few steps that lead up to her kitchen, and while he was up there, I bolted out the door into the house, and just back home, and proceeded to watch YouTube on my Kindle, a Kindle type of tablet, and hide in my room. The end. When I came out, it was like four hours later, and it was dinner time. Continue. Okay, Ashley. Here. Okay. Here's another funny story. Um. So I'm at my old, at my other house again. Um. Ooh, I, like I was playing this, this game. Called, I like this one. Yeah, I was playing this game called ABC. Yeah. It's like a learning game. Thing. Okay. Continue. And. I got mad because my mom said, no, you cannot do that. And I was like, Wait, what, what were you doing? Remember the accident when I broke her phone? No, oh, Ashton. Well, well, no, I mean, well, like, what were you doing for her to get mad at you? I threw broccoli on her face. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, now. Anyways, and she got really mad at me. She's like, no, you're not playing ABC Yacht because yesterday you threw broccoli in my face. I'm like. No, oh, I did. It was only the next day. Okay. okay. I'm like, no, I did it. And she's like, yeah, you did. I'm like, so then I ran off, and she was like, I'll be back. I'm going to the bathroom. I'm going to the bathroom. <laughs> and don't do anything bad. So don't she, touch my phone. Yeah, don't touch my phone. You're or not allowed to play games. Or you're not allowed to play games on it. So then she went back in the. That's what she told me. Bathroom. Yeah. She went in the bathroom. She closed the door. I saw her Obviously. phone. It was on a table, so I climbed up the chair, took the phone, and I remember that my dad had left a hammer on the table. Wait, from, why? 
because he was working on the house. Oh, okay. From yesterday. Well, you know. The, bit, the day before. And then I took the hammer, took the mom's phone, dropped it on the floor, and just kept on smashing at it. You mean your mom's phone? Yes. Not your mom. I kept on smashing it, kept on smashing it, until so I was like, cracked. And then when my How mom did it came, not crack the I first put it time. back. It was on the other side. Of the, it was on the counter. Somehow there was a stool there. Anyways, and I put it on there. I said, Mommy, your phone dropped. I put it back. And then she was like, you you broke it, didn't you? And she, I was like, no. And then there was a hammer by it. I was so dumb back then. Yeah. And Ashton, you said you put it behind the pillow. Well, yeah, I did do that, too. Oh, but then she found it. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Then his mom found it, and it leads to this. Yeah. Okay, okay, it's continue. It's supposed to continue. And then I got grounded again, and I got very mad. And that happened. And he acted like a lion. Yes. Okay, come to think of it, our childhood, for, when we were younger, we were cursed. I think somebody put a curse upon us. Our childhood were cursed. Wait, that means we're cursed now. Back then, at least. All right. Ashton has so many good stories, but I don't. And I say I remember a lot of stupid stuff. Because I was a troublemaker a lot back then. Yeah. Seriously. I was too. <laughs> okay, yes, I was. Oh. Please don't laugh. Okay, this happened when I was four or five, so you can laugh at me. But... When I was younger, and also do not ask how I made up this story, because, uh, okay, I mean, the story I'm about to tell you, I didn't make up, but there's, like, a story. It was thin, so, yeah. Don't ask how I got that in my mind, it's, so, when I was younger, I made up this story, it's called, like, the Night Wolf, they're basically this, like, mutant monster wolf that came from Mars, and there's, and there's, like, we have this, like, rocky path, um, it's, yeah, and at the end, there's, like, a circle where you can park cars and stuff. But, and I used the story to tell that's where the rocket ship landed, and that's why it's a circle. And so, yeah. And I told it so much when I was, and I turned, like, five, um, or I was still four, something like that. I, um, started to believe they were real. <laughs> When I was younger, I had this bed, but I was, by the way, when I was younger, I had this bed where under it, there was, like, these doors that, where you could go under the bed. I don't know why, but it was cool. I was terrified of it because I thought that the night wolves could somehow teleport under my bed. By the way, that's also part of the story. They can teleport. So, yeah.